Elisa with Terry Vision. I'm here with men's basketball coach Mike Young. Coach, heading to Mercer thir for a game Thursday night. Last time you played Mercer here at home, you defeated them 49-46. to It was a tight game and a very defensive game. What do you expect in the game Thursday night? I think it would be much the same. Um, I, I do think both teams will score more. But, um, you know, similar teams, Elise, uh, they're not going to beat themselves offensively. By that, I mean they don't turn the ball over. They're going to take great shots. Uh, consequently, there aren't uh, a lot of transition opportunities defensively. They're not going to beat themselves. They hang in there. They don't gamble. People are where they're supposed to be. Uh, they're very uh, technically really sound. So. You know, I do think it'll be another tight one. Uh, I do think it'll be low scoring uh, again, but, um, I, you know, it'll be another good college basketball game. I, I feel certain of that. Now, Mercer's 12-2 and two at home, and Mercer's typically a very tough environment to te for teams to go in and get a win at Mercer's home court. What do you expect, and how do you expect your boys to handle that environment at Mercer? Well, they've handled it with a plum uh, from start to finish. You know, that's why you go into places like Cameron Indoor Stadium, uh, at Stanford to open the year, uh, at Chattanooga. You know, we're, we're four months, four and a half months into this thing, and um, you've seen a lot of things. You've been in a tough environment. You've played against really good teams. Uh, that coupled with the fact you know, uh, Skinner and, and, and Carl Cochran, uh, the, and the, the minutes those guys have played and all the, you know, uh, tough environments those guys have been exposed to and, and Spencer Collins, Eric Garcia, I could go on and on. Uh, you know, you, um, it, all that matters is playing well. Um, I know they've got a beautiful facility and, uh, and I, I'm sure they're expecting a big crowd, but, you know, it's on us. Let's go play well and uh, do what we do well, and I uh, hope that that's good enough. And now one one way of clinching a share of the regular season and earning a number one seed. How do you expect to keep the boys focused on the on this, this game at hand and not the bigger picture? Um, so we don't talk about it. You know, I, I mean, they're smart guys and uh, competitive guys. I, I, I know they know where we are. I have not said a word. Um, it is Mercer. That's all that matters. We've got a great opportunity against a really good team uh, to uh, compete again and play well again, um, you know, as we head into the final weekend of the regular season. Um, so, you know, I, I'm not going to allow myself, and, and it's not going to be something that, uh, that we talk about um, you know, the process and the process ends on Saturday uh, at, uh, you know, the next uh, next one on the road. Uh, and then you, uh, you know, you look uh, ahead to, you know, the following weekend. But um, we've got our hands full with Mercer and uh, we will um, concentrate all of our efforts on that game right now. Well, Coach, good luck Thursday night against Mercer and thank you for your time today. Elise, thanks a lot.